a leading assist provider in the Premier League, La Liga, Champions League, and World Cup, a three-time Ballon d'Or nominee, and a World Cup winner. Mazout Azil enjoyed a stunningly successful spell at the top of the game, but his career has collapsed, and many fans don't even know whether he's retired or still playing. Join us as we discover what the hell happened to Mazout Azil. One for the ages. Mazout Azil experienced some spectacular moments throughout his career. Possessing unique technique and vision, the German was considered as one of the best footballers in Europe. The midfielder burst onto the scene in 2010, leading Germany to third place in the World Cup, performances which earned him a move to Real Madrid. In his three-year spell with the Spanish Giants, Ozil was nominated for the Ballon d'Or award every single season. Mazout was in his prime, but he wanted to be the team's star man, and Arsenal presented the perfect opportunity for him. A message to the Arsenal fans. I know everyone would appreciate that. One sentence in English. I am a Ghana. <laughs> the Germans' arrival in English football was met with much fanfare, and even though he couldn't help Arsenal win the Premier League, he won eight trophies for the North London side and registered the second highest number of assists in one single season with 19. On top of that, he won the World Cup with his national team in 2014. His former coach at Arsenal, Arsene Wenger, was delighted with his performances. He's world champion, he's been world champion, he's been a top uh, assist uh, player in, in the league, in the Premier League. So that means uh, there's exceptional quality there. A top assist provider in the Premier League, La Liga, Champions League, Europa League, European Championships and World Cup, Azil seemed to have the footballing world at his feet. But suddenly, his career collapsed to the point that most fans don't even know where he's currently playing or if he's retired. How on earth has it come to this? Unfortunate events. The Germans' descent started in 2018 after a disappointing season with Arsenal and a disastrous World Cup campaign with Die Mannschaft. Ezeel was the target of racist insults by German fans due to his Turkish roots and decided to retire from the national team. I am German when we win and Turkish when we lose. The midfielder was still a key player for Arsenal although that situation was about to change. He failed to replicate his early form with the Gunners, propelling head coach Mikel Arteta to drop him. And in 2020, there was a huge fallout between them. According to media reports, Arteta tried to convince the Gunners squad to take a wage cut, but Azil wasn't convinced. He wanted more assurances over where the money would go. Despite receiving criticism for his refusal, the German committed to covering the wages of Gunnersaurus, the club's beloved mascot. By January 2021, the relationship between the player and Arteta was irreparable. The Spaniard refused to admit this, but the end was nigh. I don't know what is going to happen, uh, so I prefer not to, to talk about that. Um, what Mesut is on the football club is unquestionable. To the surprise of no one, Azil left Arsenal just days later and joined Turkish giants Fenerbahce, the team he supported as a child. It seemed like the perfect opportunity for Azil to rediscover his best powered on by the love of the fans and his status as a star player. But again, his woes continued. And after only 18 months, the club and the player parted ways. Fellow Turkish side Istanbul Başakşehir Shahir scooped him up. It seemed his last chance at resurrecting his career. But after falling into obscurity once again, his journey seemed to have reached its inevitable conclusion. Retired in the shadows? With seemingly nowhere else to go, the press announced Azil's retirement from professional football. The guy who remained at the top of the world game for over a decade had hung up his boots. But wait, Mazout never actually confirmed it himself, and his representative told DPA that he's still committed to his team. There's nothing to it. He will definitely finish the season at Bashak Shahir. At the time of recording, Azil has featured in four league games and one Turkish Cup match, starting just two of them. At 34, his career has nosedived so quickly that almost nobody was surprised to hear that he had retired. But the midfielder still wants to carry on playing a little longer. His career didn't deserve a final chapter like this. But if the end of his playing days are near, there's just one thing left to say. Thanks for the memories, Mazout. Mazout Azil was considered one of the best midfielders in the world. But his career took a sudden nosedive, and many are even unsure to whether he's even still playing. Where do you think he should see out his career? Let us know in the comments. Among many other greats, Azil had the privilege of playing alongside Cristiano Ronaldo. As is the case with Mazout, CR7 is facing the last chapter of his spectacular career. Did you know that the Portuguese star has finally broken a curse that followed him throughout his entire career? Check out Oh My Gold's video to find out. See you next time!